Man, man them are rocking 30, 40, 50 bag wrists and they're not anybody. Back in the day, only bad boys rocked chains. People have been saying, how can they support the channel? Chisel, buy, chisel. I've got tops, I've got hoodies, I've got the Dragon Ball Z tees, like the Pain and Full Star tees. You lot could support, buy some of the merch. I'll be able to churn out more content. This one, I'm just waiting by myself for the, for the moment and I'll bring out more colors. Please support. You should be able to enjoy yourself in this life, but if you're gonna have expensive items in you, Bro. you're gonna have expensive fists. <laughs> To, the, 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 to the Houston girls, they were saying to me that, mm. open carry. Yeah. Yeah. So if anyone tries to rob them, pop, 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 hold they, that. Literally, you drive with the guns on their lap. Yeah. I'm like, it's are you, mad. Are you, are you for or against that? Should, should you, to what extent should someone be able to defend their property? To what extent? I'm for it. To what extent? Huh? Should someone, if someone comes to, to rob you, and let's say, yeah, for instance, No, I'm for it, fully. At first I wasn't, but mm. the way, the way, especially the way the climate is over here mm. and the way things have been happening, mm. and man them have just been getting caught off guard, disarmed. Yeah. I'm like, rah, you saw the other day, the youth that got killed. Yeah, rest in peace, man. You know what I'm saying? That's, that's, that's sad that's though, man. That's proper sad. So that, that, is... kind of, that, that kind of tells you that, rah, it's getting really, it's really, it's really sticky. It's really, really sticky. So like, it's, it's sticky. If, if, if we was like in America and we could have that, bro, I'll probably have like four of those. I'm not even going to lie to you. Just so mm. that I don't get caught off guard. Yeah, because that's, 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 that's a techie yeah, thing. It's, because a, it's a very, very techie thing. It's very techie because... All, all, all my friends, in, literally, all my friends in Atlanta, the same thing as well. Yeah. All of them strapped up. My boy was here the other day uh, during the weekend when man had someone love. We went to yeah. a basketball game mm -hmm. and was bossing joke about it. And he goes, he goes, bro, I just got two in my car. He goes, I sleep with one next to my bed. And he goes, right, there's one like by the front door. Mm -hmm. I said, yeah. I said, when you get to war, he goes, bro, like home invasions out there is real as well. So the way man them are over here saying this is happening, that's happening outside, mm. out there, people are burgling yeah. homes. Like there's a uh, Futures uh, manager, Ebony Ward. She put like a few months ago a video of robbers breaking into a house. Yeah. So she was in another state now and, you know, the ring... Ring bell thing. Yeah, the ring bell things picked it up. The other cameras in her house, and she mm. put it on her Instagram, and they was like ransacking through the whole house and all of that. And she's like, "Rah, what if she was in? Because she's usually by herself. Yeah. What if she was in home alone and this happened? Like, what would have happened to her? That's one thing I can't rate is is that. Imagine your house being burgled. Yeah. That's your home. That's your home. That happened to one. That happened to you, a, you a, wouldn't a even, lady you, I know in you, you wouldn't even feel comf comfortable going back to your house. Yeah. You even, know what I mean? Even, even my, oh, I'd not say his name, but even someone I know as well that's really close to me. Yeah. They burgled his house in Kent. Yeah. About six months ago. Yeah. Imagine coming. Oh, this. Yeah. We're in sticky times, man. And yeah. And even when I went to Ghana the other day, I was looking. I was looking at Ghana, and I always say that um, I've been in Nigeria, I've been in Ghana, and one of the difference between the two countries that Ghana is so much more peaceful. Yeah. You feel a lot more safer in Ghana. Yeah. But then I was having a conversation with someone out there, and I was saying that you know the only main difference between countries like Ghana and Nigeria and England is that we have a welfare system here. Imagine they took away the welfare system here, where you could not live for free. Do you know how chaotic this country would be? Look at the robins we have now, where you can actually sign on and be universal credit. Imagine they took away the whole welfare system. It would be, I'll die. I'm not going to help you. I know you was. I'm not going to help you. It was. You're feeding yourself today, mate. What was that, five reps? Yeah. I don't think I can even get two. Oh, and you weigh over hundreds. But for well, well, the past four months, I ain't been training. Mwah, mwah. Like it's, it's, it's trying to come back. I thought, let me wear a little tight top today, just in case I have to back it. <laughs> it looks like man's been training, innit? You see the thing about Ghana and Nigeria as well, yeah? Even when people ain't got much here, they're still happy. <laughs> think, it, but isn't that happy because they don't know anything different? No. No? No. They see everything here. But, boy, I tell you what, I can't even, I can't even say it like that, because where I'm from, Robbie's yeah. are... Robbie's are high in the east, isn't boy. That part of Nigeria? Yeah, Robbie's are stupid high. And the funny thing is, they were like... If you went back to when I was little, that area was like a happy people area. Everyone was happy, everyone, you know what I mean? Everyone was like family orientated, but when most of your family escaped to like England, yeah. Germany, mm. <laughs> yeah. France, America, <laughs> you know? <laughs> when all your family escaped to the Obodoibo, mm -hmm. like instantly it, it starts to breed envy and jealousy. Yeah. So the ones who felt they were left behind and they're not seeing real money. Yeah. They buy machines and become what, what do you think? What do you think would stop? So looking at the, I would say people have always robbed people, but looking at this sudden rise and especially kettles getting robbed. Mm. What do you think, what do you think could be done? 
apart from just not wearing your watch. <laughs> there's, there's nothing in it. There's nothing. Like robbers, robbers are gonna rob in it. Robbers are gonna rob. And the thing is, like you know, before yeah, man, them like our generation, man, them don't buy watches unless it's got like paperwork and all of that. Yeah. But this generation, they don't care, man. They just copying that second hand, yeah. hanging on their wrist straight away. They don't, you know what I mean? But I was speaking to one of um, one of my mates who you know, don't mention his name. He was, but he made a really valid point. He said, back in the day, yeah, if you're talking like mid '90s, yeah. early 2000s, he said only bad boys rocked rollies and walked watches and chains. He said if you was not a bad boy, yeah, you never had no rollie or chain. You would yeah. never wear one, yeah, because you'd get robbed. But yeah. things have changed now, where Everyone. man, them are rocking 30, 40, 50 bag wrists, and they're not anybody. Back in the day, only bad boys. It's not that they're not rocked chains. Not anybody is not the right word to use. But you get what I'm saying? No, but it's a, okay. You think about growing up. If you remember all the olds we looked up to, the guys who had the big chaps, the big chains. <laughs> They were men that you wouldn't just like. Yeah, yeah, you if, you, if, you rock, if you rocked a chain, a big chain, you were somebody. <laughs> Man, it was rocking big. You were somebody, right? Kilo Cubans were. But now I think money's a lot. I don't know whether I think a lot of a lot of people now are making money. Yeah. Who weren't on the road or making it illegally? You can actually people are making money easily now. I think. Easily. No, but it's it's a good thing because now. Even the younger. Uh, I'm only the spot, you know. Even it's the younger just, generation, you're seeing a lot of the younger generation. They're the ones with the big watches, you know what I mean? They're the ones who are doing very, very well. But now they found different avenues of making money, whether it's, whether it's, drop, whether it's drop shipping, YouTube. Let's go. One, two. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Last one, come on. last one. Come on. Nah, I'm going to die. If he dies, he dies. Nah, oh, come on, man. It's gone. Oh, I used to get seven reps, you know? I was getting ten. Oh, I was getting 13 actually. You did not get 13 on three plates. Brother. No, you did not. I'm going to send you a video. No, you didn't. I'm going I'm to send you a video I'm on saying, Insta. I'm not, I'm not even a hater. I'm going to send you a video on Insta. You're strong, but stop I'm it. I'm going to send you a video on Insta. 30 reps of three plates. I'm going to send you the video on Insta. When we finish, I'm going to send it. You didn't I'm going to send you a video on Insta. You didn't do it. I'm going to send it on Insta. You didn't do it. 13 that, reps. Remember the day I got four? Of what? The day I got four. The day when them man kept on putting the thing wrong, then eventually I got the four. And the four plates, yeah? Yeah, yeah. That's the day I got 13. No. I'm going to send you a video. <laughs> this guy, I told you, Gabe was Gabe was my biggest I'm hater. hater. If it's true, this is a tight top boy. Ooh. You're feeling yourself now, ain't it? No, cause bro, the way I lost bare size is coming back little by little, like it's. You've got that James Bond hair, hairy chest. True, obviously, man's wearing the Chinese extra medium. It's looking. Smee. Well, no, I'm feeling better now, though. For the past yeah. three months, I've been feeling good, but. Getting back now. Listen, feeling, summer's coming. This, no, I'm this, feeling a bit better now. The sunshine has hit you. Nah, man. It's when business holds you back a bit. You just feel a bit... You get me? You feel your empire crumbling. You get me? It's coming back. Why, why did you lick your lips there, bro? I didn't want to see that. Let's see what? I didn't want to see you lick I your lips. lips. You ain't got nice lips. I wouldn't lick you. I was looking like I'm licking my lips for you. Hey, two lines, bro. You got a nice smile, though. I know, I'm I know. You, like, your teeth are pretty white. I know, I know, I know. They, you got they, a nice smile. Yeah. No, no, don't say you know. Take I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Take the no, no, I know, I know, I know. No, don't say you know. No, Gabriel, I know. No, say thank no, you. No, no, I know. No, say thank you. I know. No, say thank you. Thank you, but I know. I know, I know, I know, I know. I know. Don't you see? Don't you see when I do videos and pictures? I purposely. Or the YouTube, I purposely. No, no, you got a nice smile. Yeah, nice smile. I, I can know. give you that. It's, it's my mum's. I can give you that. She done well. Yeah, she done. She done. She done well. Fantastic. She done well. Amazing job. You know. She done well. We still jealous about yesterday, ain't it? No, no, you know, I can't even lie because I was I was busy yesterday. Oh, yeah, no, ah, oh, yeah, this is what I wanted to say. So yesterday, I was talking to uh, uh, Terry Walker and Yawande from Love Island. Mm -hmm. and, you know, like I was talking to Yawande before Terry came. I was thinking in my head, ah, oh, you're pretty in real life. Yawande's no, punchy. Yeah, pink, no, no, she's pink. Are like, pink? Yeah, no, she's no, what? I didn't want to say it. Yeah, then Terry Walker has come like tipsy and said. Like, Yoane is talking to her, and she's talking to her, and she goes, Rah, you're pretty in real life. Then I said to Yoane, you know, I, I, didn't want to, I, I didn't know how you, you take it, so I didn't want to say it, because mm. I didn't know whether I'll offend you saying that. Then Terry true, Walker, you know, yeah, yeah. The lines are a bit, the lines blurred, are a bit blurred right now. Right. So when Terry said it, she goes, no, 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 I've heard a few people say that to me. But I was thinking mm -hmm. to myself, like, I was literally thinking it. You know, so I was talking to her, and just looking at her, thinking, oh, yeah. you're actually proper. No, then, no, she's she's like, right. then she's like, right, is it that I didn't look good in... Love Island, and we both said, nah, but just... 
No, no, she's nice though. Just like, you just look. You've got to be mindful. You can't yeah, just be you can't playing just compliments. Be playing. Yeah. Be creepy, but, yeah. But I'm so, happy you read the room. Huh? Oh, I'm yeah. I'm happy yeah, you read yeah. the room. Some man don't have like to read the room. I, I read it early, boy. Yeah, read the room. <laughs> Especially you, what? The other day when my man was trying to put the mat underneath. Yeah, but see with that now, we can discuss that too. You see with that, you've got to read the room in it. Brother. Mind your business. And that, the, the lady who was doing the exercise in the gym, she clearly looks like someone who trains. Who she, so she clearly, if that's how she's doing it. She knows what she's doing. She knows what she's doing yeah, in yeah. it. And I think it's fair to say that you need to know how to read the room. Do you know what I mean? You're walking over to a lady, giving her the mat. At the same time, he wasn't rude. He, as soon as she said no, he walked off by the looks of it. And he wasn't, so, so that so, should have ended there, innit? So, someone someone, someone in, in, in the comments said, uh, they go to the same gym that he does it to guys as well and does it to women. So they think he might be on. on, the, on the, the, yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah. they think he might be. So that like, he just don't know you how to. You can tell he didn't, he didn't mean it in yeah, a way. Yeah, yeah. But once so, again, mind your own business. Yeah, like he just thinks he's just being helpful. So I was like, I get it, but now it's mm. gone viral. Yeah, but you know. But it's you know, literally gone viral. But if, if we're going to be honest, yeah. So in, I've been gymming what? I started gymming when I thought I was going to jail. That was when? 2006, I thought I was going to jail. I started yeah. going to gym. Yeah. And if I want to be, I mean, that's what? How many years is that now? 16 years. 16 years. In the gym, I, I do assist guys as well. If I see a guy in the gym doing an exercise wrong and he looks like a new beginner, I say, yo, bro, I, like the tricep machine. Often you see guys doing the tricep from here. Yeah. I'm like, bro, just... You, you, just bro, uh, you know, you, you know I don't assist no one no more. You don't? Nah, man. I see some people yeah. hurt themselves. And nah, that's why I'm the, quick to the, kind the, of just... The, the, climate, the climate made me become... I don't even help man them. So, Seriously? Yeah, yeah I, don't, I don't help no so one. If you see a guy that's doing something wrong... Bro, I put my headphones in my ear. Like, I literally, I've learned how to mind my business. But that's, the other day, uh, Agent Harvey from my gym mm. made that meme video. Yeah. And someone took it off his TikTok and it went viral. And I was just like, when he made the video, I said to him that, right, you know this is going to go viral, isn't it? I said, right, mm. on Instagram, everyone's going to key, key, key. On, on, on TikTok, everyone's going to, some people are going to finish you. Then it, it made it to Twitter. Oh my God. And it started, the, didn't it? The thing piece has started. And I said to him, when, I, when he made it, when I heard the audio, I said, this shit's funny as fuck. But I'm like, in my head, I'm not using this audio. Because I already know <laughs> what, what's going to come in the audio. And it's, yep. like, it's like exactly what you said. Oh, you didn't save me. So the video was uh, the woman going, ah, ah, yeah, yeah. ah. And he's gone. Yeah. He's gone back to rowing. And a couple of men in the comments have said, oh, yeah, like, you have to mind your business. And blah, blah, blah. And, it's kind of, and the women were saying that, raw. this is why they stay using their new word cells and that it was like right this is why mm. blah 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 this that that and well, I, just, I, think, I just in my head thinking to myself that raw you know what now a lot of guys are scared they're actually scared to even no, approach think, women no, in public spaces is, just based no, on I, i'm not scared because social think, media no, no, but, 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 but no, you, you got yeah but There's this places is and but this is times to do things but this is what i tweeted over there i said raw like man has to be less on on the internet, because in the real, in real Look, life, exactly, in real life, they say what's happening out there. Like exactly, the, wasn't it the other day where we was complaining on the reverse, where girls were touching man up in my rave as yep. man is walking through the crowd, and women were basically violating man. And I was like, right, in real life, it's the opposite where us lot are like all like like even you see the videos from that day where I posted when we're all in the section. Man, them girls, everyone just party together, yeah. having fun. We're buying food, we're buying drinks, everyone's having fun. Everyone's jumped in the car and just went home casually. Yeah. <laughs> like, no one, you know what I mean? But I think, but, I so think I'm like, any guy that doesn't, but I think any guy that doesn't understand, obviously, there's, there's, it's blurred lines, there's grey areas, but, and I keep mentioning reading the room. But you, but you, you got, got to, to remember, when to intervene and when not to. But you got to remember, a lot of this age here, like, even the people who are always warring online, mm. I realise when man's outside, you don't see these people. True. So, Everything they know about life is just based on that little bubble you're in, which is the internet. But the internet. So they're already stuck in the metaverse and they don't know what's happening out in real yeah. life. No, it's true, but I just think you just got to know once again when to read the room, man. Because I don't think you need to be doing think pieces on when to help any human being and when not to. Do you know what I mean? Sometimes I've been in the gym and I may not pretend. There is something called pretty privilege. There is. We, we give preferential treatment of who we want to help and who we don't want to help. Um, let's not pretend. Like, I always see guys in the gym turn into personal trainers when a pretty woman's doing something. Brother, I see, I see, I see it in the other gym. Hmm? Uh, yeah. West Croydon. Happens all the time. I see it all the time West Croydon. I'm like, right, everyone's a PT. Yeah, and I think, for me, I always say that, once again, mind your own business. And also, you have to say to yourself, 
how much eye contact have you had with this woman? I'm see, I've seen brothers, I've seen a woman running on the treadmill, doing high intensity training on the treadmill with headphones on. I've seen a guy stand next to this woman on the treadmill and try and start a conversation with this woman running. Sicko. No, no, as I'm saying, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. like brother, like, it's just, <laughs> if, she, if she's rude to you, it's your fault. Like, like, allow it, innit? This woman is running for her life on the treadmill. Holiday the following day. She's trying to fit in that bikini. And you're trying to talk to her. Like, oh, babe, babe. <laughs> like, come on, read the room, man. Do you know what I mean? Like, even like, even when I go out, let's say like I'm going to try and speak to a woman. If that woman has not given me any eye contact, I don't chat to her. I don't chat to her. No, it's mad, yeah. I don't chat to her. Because you've got to think about how, how, how daunting it is for a stranger that you don't know coming to chat to you. And especially if you don't find him attractive. Maybe he's a big black guy and he's right in your space. It's sometimes... Even in that video, one person said, oh, but she was smiling. Some women do a nervous smile just to get out of the situation. Some women are being polite to avoid getting punched in the face. Like it's not, like it's not as easy as it is. Even though sometimes women do complain, I think it's a bit, you're being a bit weird in it because you really say you don't want no men to approach you, you do. So stop it. But at the you same know what's time- mad, yeah? <laughs> Go on. Uh, the internet. Uh, no, I saw someone campaigning. Oh, this thing's too tight, man. I saw, I saw someone, put it in reverse. I put it on in reverse. Pause, man. It didn't sound right, bro. You just give it words. Bare, bare work to do. No, man. but it just sounded like you said put it in reverse, like like to say, I don't know, like it just didn't, it just didn't feel right. No, I'm saying turn it <laughs> inside out. <laughs> so, uh, what do you call it? Yeah, I saw one girl who was in comments mm -hmm. campaigning about men should leave women alone, mm. but at the same time, you know, like the same person has no DMs and they think, but you're always jumping into my DMs. Every, <laughs> but <laughs> so it, instantly I just laughed because I was like, "It's no DMs from those people you don't like." But you you're the, the you're the one who's always in my DMs. I never like <laughs> I never jump into you know them ones. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> nah, I'm dead. Finish Come on, man. <laughs> push, 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 push. Oh God! God damn! Yeah. So. In my head, I'm thinking, rah, you say no DMs and all of this, you're in them comments, but you're always in my DMs. And I'm thinking to myself, just gotta read the room, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, no, no, so also, you know, no, but you know what gets down to mm -hmm. as well? Unfortunately, every man's not equal. Oh, 100%. Yeah. It's not a fair game for everyone. It's not a fair game. So, even remember before when I was saying when a certain someone used to be around, yeah, and a certain someone would come out and we try to do certain things, yeah, and I'm like, rah. The, the way I vibe and rapport with certain people, the way you see them, like when they see me, and they, <laughs> don't do that with them. Yeah. Because. Yeah, yeah, it's not the same. <laughs> it's not the same. Yeah. Like they're gonna start moving. You get me? Like th they're moving to me like that, and I'm just chilling. But you're thinking that raw because they're comfortable around me that mm. you're gonna get the same yeah, vibe. It's not, it's not horses for courses. Everyone has their different. Different lane. Know your lane. Yeah. And no, I think know what works for you. If you like the topics, please like, subscribe, keep on sharing, uh, keep on posting. I appreciate when I see people tagging and posting me. Like I see it all. Uh, also, I see all the comments as well. I try to keep up with it. It's a lot going through. Old videos, new videos, and yeah, please support the merch. Thank you.